Oh, Steve Mills here. And uh, today I want to talk to you about the changes in marketing. Uh, one thing I can tell you for certain about marketing is it's going to change. How do I know that? Well, for the last 29 plus years, I've been working with small businesses, helping them to improve their marketing and sales. I've learned my skills and my knowledge by learning from many of the world's leading marketing, sales, business growth experts, and then passing that information on to my small business clients. That's what I've been doing for all this time. Now, Here's an interesting fact. We all know about email marketing. If you're on my list, then you're going to get emails on a regular basis from me. And uh, most of those are information emails. If you want to go on to that list, then just use, if I move that there, you'll see my uh, website behind me. Use results stevemills.com and that will give you access to uh, sign up to my uh, email tips, hints, ideas, and strategies that will help you to grow your business. Now, I'm not here to talk about that, but what I am here to talk about is conversion. Now, I hear all the time, you know, oh, well, you know, email, you know, nobody's opening emails, you know, emails are a waste of time, you know, email marketing is a thing of the past. And I'm here to tell you, BS, it is just not true, right? Simply not true. You know, it is true that, you know, um, open rates are, are, are not as high as they were. Um, it's true that, you know, le maybe less communications going through email. We've now got, you know, things like WhatsApp and, and uh, Google Messenger and Facebook and, you know, blah, blah, blah. Um, but email is still alive and living and very, very powerful. And if you've not developed an email list, then I want you to uh, ask yourself one question. How much is not doing email marketing costing me? Now, I don't know the answer to that question, but I do know, or I certainly believe, it's probably a small fortune in lost income, in lost leads, lost sales. So, you know, now's the time to go and do that. Another thing I want to talk about, arguably, a, a change. You know, when, when something changes, you know, it, it goes from here and all of a sudden it's like this. Now, this is something that for years I, I've actually been quite against, and that is the use of text messaging or SMS messaging, as it's sometimes called, but basically sending out a text message. Yeah, and I'm sure you've all had the annoying, you know, Domino's pizzas, you know, because you bought a pizza once over your mobile phone, and now they're telling you you can get a special twelve ninety nine one for nine ninety nine. I, I used to get lots of those. They were very annoying, and uh, um, I don't get so many now. But I, I'm not sure quite why that is. Maybe they've given up, <laughs> given up ghosts with me. But anyway, point B conversion that's that's the whole secret you know how many people convert if you're doing linkedin marketing how many inquiries do you get and what's your conversion rate i talk about this all the time to my clients because it is so incredibly important people tell me oh yeah i'm doing really well on linkedin i say oh right you know how many leads do you get oh i don't I'm really got any leads but i'm, I'm getting like you know a thousand people liking my post you know, try sticking that in the bank. Does that really make that much difference? I'd rather get two leads uh, and and nobody like my post than a thousand leads and uh, sorry, a thousand uh, likes and no leads. Wouldn't you? Wouldn't you rather get leads and sales than likes and shares and what have you? So you know, really, really important. However, let's just go back and talk about this SMS or text messaging. Conversion rate, right? How many people, if you send if you send out an email, the world average is an open rate, in other words, a read rate, assuming they read, of 15%. If you're doing really well, like, I mean, I get sort of 40 to 60%, which is really, really good, way above average. Um, but, you know, if you're getting 15, 20, 30, 40%, you're still doing pretty well. What would you think is the average for SMS text messaging? 
98% open rate. So my message to you today is if you're not already collecting mobile phone numbers as part of your marketing, you know, on your website, on LinkedIn, if you're not trying to get hold of people's mobiles and getting them into your uh, your uh, CRM system, then you need to. Now, there's one slight problem with this, and that is not every uh, CRM system allows you to mass market to people's uh, mobiles. But the one I endorse, the one that I sell, uh, does. It's called the Results Mastery Hub. This is a, a site that um, I, I've been using now for a long, long time, and I fully recommend it. It is really, really brilliant. And if I want to send a, an, a, a, nearly said an email, then uh, if I want to send an SMS, a text message out to 5,000 people, I can do that and I can do it in an instant. You know, I can send this uh, just a, a little message reminding people, telling people about something and so on and so forth. And I, I don't even need a mobile phone to be able to do it. So, you know, it, definitely speak to me, get in touch with me about the hub. I'll be very happy to do a demo. Or if you go to my website, if you go to Results Mastery, you'll be able to find a video demo on there. You could go and watch that. But, you know, I suppose my overarching message is go and do something about growing your email database because you still, you know, could get 40, 50% open rates and uh, start collecting um, mobile phones and and therefore uh, hopefully access round about the 98% open rate. So that's all I've got to say. If you want to know more from me, if you want to book a meeting, uh, if you want to subscribe to my email list, if you want to find about find out about my podcast, if you want to uh, uh, connect to me on YouTube, subscribe to my channel to get all my updates of all my other videos, then you, you know you know what to do. It's really easy. So uh, yeah, go and find me, and uh, I'd be very happy to speak to you. By the way, if you go to my website. There's a page with a list of my LinkedIn contacts, my Facebook, my Twitter, my, my YouTube, my everything. So I'm very contactable should you wish to do so. Uh, other than that, thank you ever so much for listening. And I hope it's been of value. And I look forward to speaking soon. Thank you.